Joining me on the line all the way from Singapore, Daniel Mini T. Williams with some huge breaking news, mate. Uh, you're fighting for a world title. Yeah, bro. Yeah, sorry, just get my uh, room cleaned at the moment. Um, yeah, yeah, crazy, man. That's all you know. We just spoke about it and literally like soon after that video, the fight was changed. You got the opportunity to fight uh, Superlek, which is an absolute Thai legend. And um, yeah, crazy turn of events the last few days, but... Yeah, feeling ready for it. What what what's the whole process like? Like what happens? You obviously were gonna fight uh Botello, uh Rod Tang was gonna fight Superleg, and then what happened? Did they give you a call, say Rod Tang was injured? Pretty much the day before. I was with my missus, uh having a bit of food, but she was eating heaps of food. I wasn't. And I'm like, man, I just I hope freaking Rod Tang pulls out so I can go fight Superleg and I can eat something. And um as a joke, right? And and then um yeah, fuck, man. And then literally the next day, I got the message from one like, hey, Dan. And I, wa- I wanted to message on there, um, hey, Superlek, question mark. It was just this weird feeling. <laughs> but um, anyway, yeah, and then I got the got the call and then they told me, I'm like, fucking oath. And I went to the uh, the restaurant next door and just smashed myself some food straight away because obviously a heavier weight. And I got what I wanted, man. I can eat and I get to fight a legend. And that's what it's about, you know, fucking fighting the best rather than, yeah, trying to work your way up and fighting people that no one really cares about. Now, mate, all we're loving about this is all of Australia is behind you. No, everyone is talking about how big a balls you must have to just step in on less than two days' notice to fight for a world title. <laughs> it's so funny. Um, uh, one of my other coaches out here, Brad, he was like, "Man, you're gonna." You're going to send uh, one championship broke because they're going to have to get extra luggage for the belt and your big kahunas that you're bringing. <laughs> <laughs> um, but, yeah, it's been um, wicked support, man. We're all we're all stoked for you to bring home the belt. I just wanted you to have this one opportunity and bother you before you do your weigh-in on if you've just got a message for Australia. Oh, just tune in to 7 Plus for once. It's on free-to-air TV. It's so cool because I got to watch all my footy and cricket on seven as a kid and wanted to be heroes like the athletes there. And now they bring martial arts and my fight onto channel seven. So, um, yeah, just a massive thank you to everyone in Australia. Get behind me. It will be this Saturday posters say Friday, but that's for America. And, um, just a massive thank you guys and going to bring the battler out in me and give it all I got and bring that belt home. Daniel Mini T Williams and future world champion Australia is all behind you. Good luck, mate. Thanks, legend. Cheers, Mitch.